Hi, I'm Mike Hughes, and today we're going to do some creek crossing with Susie here. Susie doesn't like crossing creeks, and since we really don't have a creek around here, I had to do a man-made creek where I got four poles, uh, put a tarp over the poles, and then filled it with water. So that's where we're going to start with this today on the creek crossing. And that is clear water inside the tarp behind me. If we needed to, we could always put some dirt in there, swirl it around, and make it muddy. All right, so two things are going to happen when we start asking her to do this. Uh, one, wherever she stops is where the training begins. And two, I have to have, if I ask her to go forward, she has to be calm and relaxed, and I have to have a 99% chance that she's going to move something somewhere. Okay, so that's where we're going to start. This is a preview on horses, teaching horses how to cross water in creeks. Since we don't have a creek, we made a man-made creek by putting four poles down, putting a tarp in the center, and filling it with water. If I wanted to make it murky, I'd throw some mud in it and uh, stir it around a little bit. So when you walk your horses up to an object or a creek or whatever it may be out on a trail or in an arena, if they put their heads down, at least they're thinking about crossing it. So when they put their heads down, I'll leave them alone, let them look at it. And then the second thing is I've got to be able to keep her nose on the center of what she's crossing. So here when I go to ask her to move, she wants to go back to the left. I pick up my right rein and keep her nose centered on it. It's not gonna do you any little it's not gonna do you any good to make her let her make little circles and stuff like that. You want to keep their nose on the center of what you're crossing. And next, if I use my legs to have her go forward, I need a 99% chance that she's gonna go forward, think about crossing it, or move something somewhere. So those are the uh, basics on crossing obstacles is what you want your horse to know. Again, you want to be nice and flex and being able to flex on the bit really nicely, both to the left and to the right, uh, before starting these exercises. This is only a preview. To see the full video, join my membership page. Just go to Google, type in Mike Hughes Horsemanship Members page, and then click on the link, and then subscribe. Once you do subscribe, Go to my group page on Facebook and ask to join our group page on Facebook where you can put your pictures, videos of you working with your horse and ask questions so I can help you and your horse more. Thank you and have a great day.